Our voyage continues apace. All systems fully operational. Uh, we had some issues with the hydroponics units, but maintenance has managed to solve that problem. And the only other thing to report is the religious fervor that seems to be gripping some sections of crew and passengers. Apparently, there's this boy. I think he's around 10 or something. And people are heralding him as the second coming. There's a rumor he can perform miracles, but it's obviously only a story. Commander Jefferson wasn't too impressed when he heard, but I managed to calm him down. Told him it was good for people to have something to believe in, especially on a voyage like this one. The situation is becoming critical. Support for the child, they're just calling him Zachariah, has developed into some sort of mass hysteria. They're hailing him as a kind of messiah. Over half the ship's population now thinks this boy is going to deliver them to the promised land. Jefferson has tried talking to his acolytes, but they no longer recognize the commander as the main authority figure on the ship. It wouldn't be so bad, but there are whispers of weird ceremonies, and people have started to go missing. I don't know what Jefferson's next move is, but he needs to do it quick if we're going to regain order. We have an emergency situation. Commander Jefferson is... He, he's dead. They killed him. An offering, they called it. He went with a security team to break up one of their gatherings and take Zachariah into custody when they just turned on him. The kid refused to go and ordered the security team to throw Jefferson out of the airlock. I can't believe they did it. It's like he has some kind of power. I, I've never seen anything like it. There's only me and a few others who don't follow him now, but it's safer if we just go along with these religious fanatics until they find their promised land and I can ditch them. I don't want to be the next one getting vented. I don't have much time. He's gonna kill everyone, and I have to stop him. Turns out, Zechariah's promised land isn't a fertile planet. It's the cold vacuum of space. He intends to open up every airlock on the ship and vent all the corridors and containment units. He just proclaimed it to the entire ship in that little voice of his. Everyone seems to be going along with it, thinking it'll take them to a higher plane or some garbage. Am I the only one here still sane? Because it sure feels like it. I have to stop him. I got a loaded carbine, and I'm not going to let anyone get in my way. I just hope I'm in time. Automated systems message. System report. Life support. Counter log requested at 0943. Manual override granted on all airlocks. Purge, initiated at 0952. Purge, complete. Purge, complete. Purge, complete. Purge, complete.